¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasa? Hola, le va a tu chingada. Samaya que está grande, chichi, con tu tortilla, mi. Hola, le. Chica, está chico tacos, mi. Chicos tacos. No, but what's up, Samaya? What's up, girl? I saw your homeboy wearing your skin leopard bra. Kind of like a ghetto Princess Leia. <laughs> But I, mean, I just want to say this, Amaya. I support you, no matter what. I watched you on Love, Hip, Love and Hip Hop. And I say this, man. I know, you, I know, you, like you want to change your look, change your breast size from an E to a D. And I can say this: you're in L.A. You're in California. There's women out there with bigger titties than you. I'm not trying to put you down or talk shit about them. But you gotta realize, man, there's women out there that's putting silicone, plastic, and all this shit in their bodies just to have bigger breasts or fatter asses. Think about it, it's mostly white women. They wanna have the ghetto booty and the grande gigi. But it, it, it's definitely like this, yes, man. You don't change your look for what? Not, for one thing is, don't change your looks because you wanna impress somebody. Don't change your looks because you wanna impress somebody or you want to look good for somebody because to me you're kidding yourself you kill kidding yourself because one thing is a brother to a sister man I don't think you should change your look just to get a part in a movie on a TV show to impress somebody or get somewhere just because you change your look what's that what's that girl that married to Spencer Pratt Heidi Heidi whatever that bitch is had all that surgery done to her just because she want to impress somebody? Come on. There's other minorities that's trying to get a body like yours, Samaya. And I support you on your choice. I support you. To me, if, if I had my way with it, I would have said, no, don't do it. I love you like you. Love you. Love you the way you are. You shouldn't change it. That's what I'm probably, probably saying now, but I. But I'm not trying to stop you from your choosing for your choices in life I just want you to be happy for who you is not for what people love you for not for people to make you change your looks it's bad enough people are getting faker and faker by the day Samaya every day somebody's changing their looks to be somebody else there's women out there that's flat chested wishing they can have titties like chichis like yours wishing and there's women that can afford to get chichis like yours and every time I see a woman uh, reducing their breast size the first thing that pops in my mind is the one thing that pops in my mind is it's like a woman thinking about it said damn I wish I never changed my breast size or changed my look or altered my look because they end up regretting it down the line and I don't want you to make a mistake and regret it. Making you regret it in life that you got your breast reduction. That you altered your look. Because that was a, I can tell you this, that was a man. He said he was growing up, he felt like a, he felt like he was a girl, he wanted to be a girl. So what'd he do? He gets the surgery. Chopped off a little wanger and he, got the breast implants and the booty lift and all this shit and he ended up being a woman for five, like for like 10 years he got to a point down the line is he made a fucking mistake that he didn't want to be a woman he wanted to be a man so he had the surgery again to be the man that he once was See, people always, see, that's what happens when it comes to surgery, Samaya. I'm not putting you down. I'm not telling you to stop. Don't do it. I wish you, like, these are the warning signs I'm giving to you, girl. That I want you to think about it before even going in to do it. Before you go in to do it, because you, because some, some, some people, once they get that little taste of their plastic surgery and shit, they get addicted to it and they're always doing it. Hair and face, lips. White woman taking some of the booty, taking some of their booty and putting it in their lips. No wonder their lips smell like shit. They breath smell like shit because when you kiss them, you're kissing their ass. I'm 
just saying, think about this before you even jump or even think about doing it. Because when you don't thinking about when you don't think of, think about it, you're gonna end up regretting it down the line. And you're gonna hate yourself for it. It's not about, well, I'm gonna get it done. I don't care for the consequences and all this that. No, you need to think about it. I'm just a word I'm the brother that's I'm like a conscious. I'm like your Wookiee conscience. Just giving you a reason to doubt that you need to sit down, think about it. It's like, do I really want to do this? Do I really want to alternate my look, alter my look to impress people? Like to me, I ain't gonna change my look. I'm always gonna have an afro. I'm always gonna be Afro Joe. I'm not gonna change my looks because somebody else depress somebody else I just think that we need you need to sit down and think about it and I as girl I'm telling you, you got the grande chichi you look like you can carry two bowling balls in that motherfucker okay <laughs> look like it looks like a oompa it looks like an Ewok swing damn your bra's like an Ewok swing but I'll tell you like is I'll tell you like this in my Think about it before you even do it. Think about it before you even do it. There's, there's, it got to a point where women get surgery on their, get their breast reduction, and something happens. See, I'm get, kind of giving you pros and con, your pros and cons a little bit. Like, there's women that actually went in for surgery to get their breast reduction. And something happens, it's, and they breast, their chi chis end up looking fucked up. It can happen in LA, it can happen in California, it can happen in California, New York, Florida, anywhere you go. Some doctors might make a mistake and fuck your shit up. The doctor might give you a one small titty, one big titty, and they call you Biggie Smalls. I hate to sit down, I hate for you to sit there and walk around. With your small chi chi and your big chi chi, and everybody calling you Biggie Small, the female version, the Latino version. Biggie, Biggie, Biggie. Ese, ese. Pichi cabron, pichi punta. What? What? I'm just saying, just think about it before you even doing it. Because you don't want to, because one thing is, I, I know you don't want to regret getting this done or think about this getting done, but you need to think about it. Take a second. Talk it out. Think about it for, like, for real, take as long as you want about doing this. Because, because one thing is, man, I always support people when they need it. And I support you, Samaya, and I think you doing you is the best thing to do. Because one thing is, I always, I always love you for who you are when the first day I met your ass on Now Live. I say, I'm always going to support you no matter what. And your fans supporting you. And your fans love you for who you are. You ain't hear one of your fans to say, Girl, you need to reduce that ass. You need to reduce them chi-chis. Damn, you got ghetto lips. You haven't. They always support you. Even the mistakes that you did, your fans was there. Your fans, your family, your friends. All the people that know and love you has supported you on what you did. I'm not hating on you. I just want you to think about it. Because one thing is, man, one fucker, man. That's it. That's it. Pass the surgery and breast reduction and shit like that, man. They cut. I just don't want you to fuck up and kill yourself. Get killed on the operating table. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Afro Joseph. Man, I hope you do a video response to this because I would love to hear what you got to say about me supporting you and trying to help you think about your uh, choices about this breast reduction. <laughs> so leave me, leave me, if you like what I got to say, leave a video response or comment on this. This is for Samaya's breast reduction. This has been if you follow me on Twitter at Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Junior 2, CeeLo Junior 3, Holla at a Wookie. Subscribe to Mother Wookie's channel. And uh peace.
love and so somebody just think about it before you do anything crazy I don't want you to do something crazy and you lose your life for it now I'm going to take that scratch that just think about it before you do it peace